Let us kneel down to welcome the Eucharistic Lord among us. Oh, 
of the divine master jesus we want to be united with him and walk in his ways let us tell the lord that we desire to be with him to be his true beloved friends and follow him closely a friend is one who knows me well understands what i have been and it accepts me as i am this is the type of friendship we desire to have with jesus jesus knows what i am and he still loves me with a perfect love Let us invoke the Holy Spirit to come upon us as we prepare ourselves to hear the word of God. जाए दिल हमारे 
reading from the book of prophet jeremiah chapter 1 verses 4 to 10 now the word of the lord came to me saying before i formed you in the womb i knew you and before you were born i consecrated you I appointed you a prophet to the nations. Then I said, Ah, Lord God, truly I do not know how to speak, for I am only a boy. But the Lord said to me, Do not say I am only a boy, for you shall go to all to whom I am sending you, and you shall speak whatever i command you do not be afraid of them for i am with you to deliver you says the lord then the lord put out his hand and touched my mouth and the lord said to me now i have put my words in your mouth see today up I appoint you over nations and over kingdoms to pluck up and to pull down to destroy and to overthrow to build and to plant The word of the Lord Thanks be to God God calls whom he wants 
We have just listened to the call narrative of Prophet Jeremiah. There are three factors in this call narrative. First, the one who calls. The second is the one who responds. And the third is a promise or a purpose or a mission for which one is called. We see this almost in every call narrative in the Bible. We too have received a call from God. We too have responded to him in love and we have a mission to fulfill. from your country and your kindred and your father's house to the land that I will show you and I will make of you a great nation and I will bless you and make your name great so that you will be a blessing so Abraham went as the Lord has told him. God called Moses from the burning bush. Moses, Moses, he said, Here am I. God said to him, I have seen the affliction of my people who are in Egypt. Come, I will send you to Pharaoh that you may bring my people, the sons of Israel, out of Egypt. God called Jonah, saying, Arise, go to Nineveh, that great city, and cry against it, for their wickedness has come up before me. But Jonah rose to flee to Tarshish from the presence of the Lord. The angel Gabriel came to Mary and said, Hail, O favored one, the Lord is with you. 
she was greatly troubled so the angel said to her do not be afraid mary for you have found favor with god and behold you will conceive and bear a son and you shall call his name jesus he will be great and will be called the son of the most high and mary said i am the handmaid of the lord be it done to me according to thy word we are about 100 of us gathered here in the presence of the lord we are called by god from various parts of our country to follow our lord through different congregations we are called and set apart by god we shall spend a little while reflecting on our vocation our response and the purpose of our call chapter 4 verse 6 says do not worry about anything but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving let your request be made known to god god is ever ready to hear us 
Let us place our prayers and petitions before the Lord, knowing that He will answer our prayer. Our response shall be, Jesus, we thank you for being with us during this time of adoration. Thank you, Jesus, for the gift of our vocation. Thank you for enabling us to reflect on this great gift. Our vocation you have given us and our response we give to you daily. Help us, Jesus, to be more responsible for our vocation to follow you closely and to lead a life of genuine gratitude throughout our life. Help us, Jesus, to remain in your love and to be united with you. We make this prayer through Christ our Lord. Amen. Little Bobby, adoration to Senses cannot grasp this marvel. Faith must serve to compensate. Glory, honor, adoration. Let us sing with one accord. Pray be God Almighty Father, praise be Christ His Son, our Lord, praise be God the Holy Spirit, Triumph God had be adored.
Blessed be God. Blessed be his holy name. Blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be his most sacred heart. Blessed be his most precious blood. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the Paraclete. Blessed be the great mother of God, Mary most holy. Blessed be her holy and immaculate conception. Blessed her glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be Saint in his angels and in his saints. Brothers, sisters, brothers, and the dear novices, we are very grateful to you for coming over to our house to pray together. I think we have prayed well. Did you all? Okay. Thank you so much for joining us, and I think it was a good experience that we enjoyed your presence here with us. We felt that all of us prayed together. and blessing is upon us okay thank you so much